guys, it is Arika Misha, and today we are cooking dinner. And for dinner, we are cooking teriyaki chicken over white rice. Teriyaki chicken over white rice. I love teriyaki anything. Anything with a teriyaki sauce on it, I love it. <laughs> chicken, teriyaki beef, teriyaki chicken, I just love teriyaki. All right, guys, so what I have, this is gonna be an easy, quick, easy meal, guys. Quick and easy. Okay, so what we have, I have the uh, five minute, ready in five minutes, white rice by minute. I love this rice, and it's not expensive either. Minute rice, white rice, light and fluffy. Look how pretty that rice looks, and it looks just like that. N nice and fluffy and white, I love it. Um, and soft, ready in five minutes. It is ready in five minutes. You just boil your water, y'all will see, boil your water, pour the rice in, cover it up for five minutes, boom, bam, done. That's what I'm talking about. Five minute rice. I'm telling you, sponsors, let's go. All right, so anyway, um, I have some butter here. I've got some soy sauce, because I'm gonna, I'm gonna make my own, I'm adding to this teriyaki sauce I have here. And I have teriyaki, teriyaki and soy sauce. I'm gonna make my own like little teriyaki sauce you know you guys will see that I'll show you that guys all right and here I have some boneless skinless chicken breast that I chopped up into cubes it was three uh, chicken breasts boneless skinless chicken breast and as you guys can see I just cut them up into a little small cubes and of course they have been marinating overnight I have to show you guys how the lay chicken is marinated overnight yes Overnight marinated le chicken. Ah, oh, it smells so good. All those seasons smell so good, guys. This is gonna be a quick and easy meal, guys. It is delicious. I cooked it a million times. I don't think I've cooked it for the channel, but anyway, we're gonna grill this chicken, get that teriyaki sauce. Oh, you guys will see. All right, let me stop talking. All right, let go. Okay, guys, I am back. I've got my butter. I put some butter in my pan here. Uh, I think I used about um, one tablespoon of butter. No, actually about two tablespoons of butter. And as you can see, my butter is ready. I'm gonna go ahead and get my chicken in here so we can get this chicken all nice and sauteed up. Get our chicken in our pan. Just gonna saute it in some butter. And I've got the chicken cut in some really nice, small cubes. Okay. Get our chicken all sauteed up. And we've got our water back here boiling for our rice. That is three cups of water back there boiling. Three cups of water. I'm just gonna go ahead, now that the water is boiling, I'm just gonna pour my three cups of rice back there. Let me show you guys that. Because I'm cooking everything together. We are getting it done. Sauteing this chicken, cooking this rice. We are just getting it done. Go ahead and put my three cups of rice in my water while it's boiling. One cup, two cups. Yeah, this box is pretty much just three cups. Actually, it's about four cups. All right, four cups. So I'm gonna go ahead and add another cup of water. We've got four cups of rice, four cups of water boiling. I'm gonna get that stirred up. Water boiling, stirring that up. I love this rice, quick and easy. So I've got my rice stirred in. I'm cutting the stove off. And I'm just gonna cover that. Covering that for five minutes. You're taking it away from the heat. As you can see, I took the rice away from the heat. 
quick and easy. I'm telling you, that rice is so easy. You bring your four cups of water to a boil. Once the water starts boiling, you um, add your same amount of cups of uh, rice. Four cups of rice I added. And four cups of water I had boiling. You pour your rice in that boiling water, take it off the heat, cover it for five minutes, voila, done. Let me cut my timer on. Five minutes for the um, rice. I'm telling you guys, that rice is too easy. All right guys, let's get this chicken sauteed. And get my chicken all broken up here. Put some more butter in here. Because the butter is gonna what what's gonna help my uh, chicken cook. So some more butter in there. Get this all sauteed up. Quick, easy meal. Sauteing your chicken. Your rice is done back there in five minutes. And I'm going to fix this teriyaki, a little teriyaki glaze sauce I make. And that's it. You guys will see. I'm going to add the sauce to the chicken. Now, we all know teriyaki sauce and soy sauce is already, you know, salty, so... You don't want to over season it. So I didn't put that much season on my meat. I lightly seasoned my chicken. Because I want my chicken to have some flavor when I cook it. So I lightly, whoa, losing chicken. So I lightly seasoned the chicken. And the chicken is going to be nice. We're going to cook it till it's all brown and that butter is going to cook in our chicken. That's going to make it all nice and soft and juicy. Yes. Get this chicken all sauteed up. It smells so good. And chicken cooks fast. Doesn't take long for you to saute some chicken in a pan with butter. Maybe five minutes, not that long. And I, I'm cooking this chicken on a medium high heat. Don't wanna cook it on high heat, that's not necessary. Just tossing my chicken around. Smells so good. Teriyaki chicken, I love teriyaki. that cook itself so you guys see I'm sauteing the chicken with some butter I'm gonna go ahead and get this chicken all sauteed and browned up and then when I come back I'll show you guys how I'm making the uh, teriyaki glaze that's gonna go over the chicken I'll be right back okay I am back and I'm getting ready to make my teriyaki sauce I got the chicken all nicely grilled show you guys that Yep, that chicken is all nice and smoky and hot, all nicely grilled in le butter. So, let's get into our teriyaki sauce that I'm going to make. Something quick and easy. Let me get myself, oh, I want to show y'all the rice. Let me show y'all the rice back here. Hold on. Get y'all zoomed into that rice. Okay, let me get that top off. I want to show y'all the rice, how it looks. When it's done after five minutes, take y'all in to the rice. I don't think so, a little grain in there. Get that little bad rice out of there. Did I get it? No, oh, I did. Okay. I always want bad rice in there. Anyway. Okay, so as you guys can see my rice, see my rice? And it's completely done. The hot water absorbs, the rice absorbs the hot water. And look at this. Look at this rice. Nice and fluffy rice. Just 
Just take your fork, stir it up. That's it. Look at that. Gorgeous, nice, soft, fluffy rice. I love that rice. It's so good. Look at it. Nice and hot and fluffy. I love that rice. Nice. All right. Let's get to the sauce. Y'all out. Okay, so my quick teriyaki sauce. Let me go ahead and get my stove on. I'm gonna be on using a medium high heat. Okay. Get some butter in here. I'm gonna say this is about four tablespoons of butter. Yeah, four tablespoons of butter. We're gonna get that butter melted. Four tablespoons of butter. Let's get some garlic in here. Make sure y'all can see. Yep, my butter is melting. All right, and I wanna get, let me get a, use my fork here. Get this garlic out. Putting some garlic in here. Uh, I say about, that's about three tablespoons of garlic. This all sauteed up. All right. Okay, yeah, you guys can see. Get this all sauteed and melted. That butter and um, butter and garlic. Get these two together first. We're gonna go ahead and let these two melt and combine that garlic and butter. Smells so good. That garlic and butter, garlic and butter together always smells good. It's a great combination. Great combination, garlic and butter. All right, so they fizz, fizz, fizzing. While they're doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and add in soy. Add a full cup of soy. Actually, I'm gonna do half a cup of soy. We're doing half soy. Now our teriyaki sauce, I'm doing a full cup of teriyaki now. Because it is a teriyaki sauce. Full cup of teriyaki. Get that poured in. Half a cup of soy, full cup of teriyaki. That's what we're doing. Okay, let's get this all stirred up together. Now we all know teriyaki and soy is uh, salty all by itself, just these two together. So, I'm going to add, now you can do honey, I've done honey before to make my teriyaki. But I also do something different. Let me taste that. That's good, salty, but now also, let me show you guys my little secret. I'm going to add Pearl Millie Butter Rich Chai Syrup. Anyway, I'm gonna add syrup because this syrup is gonna give me that sweet taste that I want. It ain't gonna taste like, like you're eating syrup, like you're eating pancakes. This syrup is just designed to give it a sweetness. I'm adding a full cup of that syrup. Any syrup you want, a full cup. Now remember, the syrup is to just give us, to give us that sweetness, gives it a sweetness. And it also gives it a thickness. Gives your teriyaki sauce the thickness that it needs. Get that stirred up. Gonna let that come to a boil after I get it all stirred up. Let me taste it. 
yummy. Let me see. I think I need to add more syrup. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's real good with that garlic. Oh, that's amazing. And like I said, the syrup is to just to give it the thickness and to give it the sweetness. It tastes amazing. Makes a nice teriyaki glaze. Won't let that boil a little bit. I am going to add, I am going to add another cup of syrup. So we've got half soy, one full cup of teriyaki, and two cups of syrup. You can use whatever syrup you want. Light syrup, healthy syrup, whatever syrup you want to use. And like I said, that syrup is just to give it the sweetness and the thickness that we want. So, half a cup of soy, one cup of teriyaki, and two cups of syrup. You guys will see. This is going to be delicious. Now, after we get our sauce together... I'm going to go ahead and pour the sauce over our chicken over here. <clears throat> you guys will see. Let's finish getting our sauce together first. Let me taste our sauce. That is amazing. Oh, that's so good. All right. I've stirred it enough. I'm going to go ahead and let it boil a little bit. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and let that boil a little bit. As you guys can see, it's boiling over there. Now, I'm going to bring you guys over here to the chicken because I'm getting ready to add the teriyaki sauce to the chicken. Get you guys right there so you can see. Because I'm getting ready to add that teriyaki sauce to the uh, chicken. Okay. That teriyaki sauce is boiling. Smells so good and sweet. I love it. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Yes. I'm gonna cut the chicken over here on a low heat. Just a low heat, because I just want to add my teriyaki sauce to it actually. Well the teriyaki sauce is already hot, so I won't cut the heat on. You're just gonna pour it into our chicken. Just going to pour it in. I'm not going to pour it all in just yet. Let me see. Yeah, I'm going to cut a low heat. You just stirring that in, putting our chicken in there. We're going to let our chicken just sit in there and soak up all that goodness of the teriyaki sauce. Get that nicely coated. Get all the chicken coated with the teriyaki sauce. Oh, that's going to be good. Oh, yeah. And also, the chicken sitting in this teriyaki sauce. Oh, it's going to make it all nice and soft and juicy. It's already juicy. It's going to make it more juicy. More juicy. Yes. All right, let's bring this heat up so we can get this going. Oh, it smells so good, y'all. All right, so we're going to let that chicken sit and soak in all that teriyaki sauce. That's all it's going to do. Just sit in there. I'm just going to let it sit there. I brought my heat up so it can come to a little boil. And voila. That's it, guys. Let me take a hand into that teriyaki chicken. Look at all that goodness. Looks so good. That looks so good, y'all. That's it. Grilled the chicken, made the sauce, put the sauce with the chicken. Our rice took five minutes back there. Quick, easy meal. We'll lay down the rice and then we'll go ahead and pour our chicken with a little sauce, teriyaki sauce, over our rice. That's it. 
teriyaki chicken over white rice. You seen me do it, so you know I did it. This is Arika Misha. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, guys, knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.